Oh, you can clap. It's okay. It's just it's so tiny. Okay. Wow. I'm sharing information. I'm not a teacher. We got to have some music in the background. No, we can't just... We got to have some background music. Uh, play your rhythm again. We're going to start. Who starts it? One more time. Now, listen, I want to say something to you. African music is organized. It's not a jam session. You know, the brothers didn't, when, when the Europeans got to Africa and they saw the brothers and sisters dancing and playing, they thought it was just some, something they made up. You know, we got rhythm. I agree. I do not disagree with that. I think we were gifted. And that's, that's a, an, it's not a stereotype, it's an attribute. Don't let nobody tell you because they say you can jump and you can run and you can dance and you can sing and think that's a stereotype. That's our reputation. I love it. We can sing. Ask Aretha. Ask Sarah Vaughan. Ask Ella Fitzgerald. I mean, you know, they can do it on a very high level. Really high. Okay, then we had drummers like Max Rose and uh, Tony Williams and uh, James Gatson. We did the funk. We took it from Africa to Hollywood. That's what we did. So I think those are good qualities to have. The brother can run. Brother can run. The fastest man on earth is from Jamaica. You know what I'm saying? It's just a fact. It ain't, ain't nothing wrong with that. You know, some people build bombs. They do it good. <laughs> Who are they? You know, everybody has something to offer the planet. Everybody has something to offer to science. Everybody has something to offer to, to spirituality. I am a Jew. I am a Gentile. I am a Muslim. I'm a Buddhist. I'm a Hindu. And I'm a voodoo priest. All of that wrapped up in the one that's cool. Yeah. It's better to say, Nam yo ho renge kyo. Or it's better to say, Ashe. It's better to say, Abaligani and Dugu, Dada. You know, we greet each other with respect. And we come together like this. There's no problems. As soon as y'all get your ass home, you know, the N word come out, the B word come out. You know, everybody, but that's okay too. Because censorship ain't good either. All right, you know, somebody said we should get rid of the N word. Please don't. Don't do that. Get, you know, like they had these statues up here of, uh, uh, they took down, uh, what's it, Lee? I said take his ass down many years ago. When I first came and saw it, I said, well, why they got Hitler up there? Would you put Hitler up there? Yeah. No, I don't think so. So, but, but then I thought about it again. I said, well, maybe we should leave him up there to rem remind us what, how bad things can really be. Never forget. Never forget. Believe me, the Japanese ain't forgetting about Hiroshima yeah. or Nagasaki. Believe that. They, I've been there, stood on the spot where they dropped that bomb. Ain't nobody forget, but people can't forgive. But don't forget. So we just, we're gonna, we're gonna, here's what we're gonna do. We're going to sing a song for my ancestors and yours. Mm. Whoever you, whoever your ancestors are. This is a nice little song. Maybe we could do this. This is easy. La ba la ba. La ba la ba. That's all you gotta do. Let me see. I don't know. That's I'm trying to think of something simple, but none of these things simple. But y'all playing the, the rhythm that we just played will work for this. But what I was going to say is the music is organized. So we have my gentleman on the end, my friend from Lebanon or somewhere. <laughs> where, where, where are you from? Indiana. Indiana. <laughs> Lebanon, Indiana, somebody said. But you look like you, you got something in you. You ain't just rolling on the other side. I know I can tell that. Yeah, there it is. Uh, mi, mi hermano, you must be from your people from Puerto Rico. Colombia. Como esta mi amigo? Todo bien? Uh oh. <laughs> you don't know nothing I say. <laughs> I ain't got, we ain't got that much time, but as long as we laughing and having fun, <laughs> it's cool. Hey, we got a great camera crew here, too. Thank These you, guys thank over you. here, they got the booms and look like Miramax. 
Weinstein didn't send you over here, did he? Was that, was that his name? Why some wines? I saw a special about him later. Oh my God. Oh, we won't even get into it. <laughs> Woo! At any rate, let's get back to the music. Okay, I don't know. We got probably 10 more minutes. But I want to show you something. Because we organize, these rhythms are organized. This is called a shikaree. Okay? And they sometimes call it akbe. But it's called a shikaree. And I make these. These are handmade. I make these myself. If you want one, you can order one. It costs about $5,000 a piece. And then I'm going to donate some to the community. Like Urban Mayfield did. Oh, so look here. Hey, man, look. I don't know about that anyway. So anyway, I'm going to leave it alone. I'm going to leave it alone. Okay. Uh, here we go. Look, here. I'm being reprimanded now. Okay. I thought I was a, a master. But anyway, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to go through these parts. Indiana Sh That's the groove. We got to be listening to something. Okay, now we got my man on the shakaray, but you double. Ding, 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 ding. See that? So he's doing ding, 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 ding. Okay, now we got the bell part. See, everybody's on. So everybody clap out there on the one. One, one. See, this is organized. Ain't nobody clapping on. No, everybody's together. It's a family. Okay, next part. Okay, we need this. I'm, I'm not going to be able to stay out here for too long because uh, we are going to the Whitney Plantation today for a five-hour tour. Uh, but this festival will be live tomorrow as well. I'll be here for the entire day tomorrow. So uh, definitely tune in and check it out. But I just wanted to bless y'all this morning with this African drum circle.
So we can't we can't stay out here the uh, entire day because, like I said, uh, we are on our way to uh, to Whitney Plantation to go on a five-hour tour there. I'm currently in New Orleans with my wife on our baby moon. Our daughter will be here in May, so we just doing a little vacation before the baby get here because we won't be able to travel this summer. Uh, but uh, what I wanted to let y'all know is that. Uh, when people say that, uh, um, you know, black Americans are not African, I want to show y'all something too. Hold up, babe. Hold on, babe. When people say that um, black Americans are not uh, African, I just want y'all to know that our ancestors did uh, keep keep alive the, uh, the traditions in more ways than one. Um, so when you travel, you do want to try and go to the places that your ancestors uh, came to. Um, you want to try and be at the places where they kept the spirit alive. So I'm going to show y'all something that's real dope. And um, I'll show y'all some pictures later on. But uh, this is Congo Square and, uh, in New Orleans. They got a couple of dope statues out here. Let me show y'all. All right. This is like a statue of our ancestors celebrating right here in Congo Square. Right. And... Uh, What a lot of people don't know is uh, this is like where the roots of Mardi Gras, uh, Mardi Gras is. Like uh, African people uh, here in New Orleans, uh, keeping alive and, and jazz, but um, keeping alive these traditions of, of West Africa, our spiritual traditions, our cultural traditions, um, keeping them alive right here. And a lot of people don't um, don't know that, but there's a lot of rich history um, in this city. So I just wanted to uh, to share that with y'all. We can't stay the entire day today, but this is a two-day festival. Um, so we will be back out here tomorrow for most of the day. Um, but I'll try and give y'all a couple of uh, live shots today from the plantation as well. Um, we're making our way there right now. So that's going to be a five-hour tour. Um, but if you can make it to New Orleans, don't just spend your time on Bourbon Street. Um, make sure you take in the history of the city, but more specifically, um, the history of our people, because this is one of the um, one of the, uh, the the richest places in terms of uh, um, African cultural heritage uh, here in the West um, that you can find. Uh, well, more so here in America, because we know a lot of our traditions were also kept alive in the Caribbean as well. Um, so that's it. Just wanted to, to let y'all see that. I hope y'all having a blessed day. All right, peace.